Living Lord, I pray for victims of every kind, for hope in you who are victimized too. For those hurt by violence, I pray for healing and peace for those used by as objects of desire or for greed. I pray for freedom and dignity. For those who livelihood has been lost, I pray for new opportunities to work. For the forgotten and neglected, I pray for recognition and love. I pray all this in Jesus Yeshua's name. Amen. How you guys doing today? I had to say a little prayer for uh, all the people right now that are everyone, man. Regardless, I don't care what race, color you are. Every single life matters. I understand what's going on, about what's you know what they're protesting about and all. But still, every, I still, me, in my opinion, I still think the message is getting set the wrong way. I understand everyone's getting tired. Yeah. Act the way I was. Uh, way I was. Uh, let me explain to you a little something today. I was act the way I was um, talking to my cousins and all today, cause they're uh, they're half Indian, basically native, native, native Indian, and um, they were all saying that they that if everyone feels like they need to get you know go protest about something, they feel like getting together and protesting and asking everyone for rent money and I'm like what do you mean rent money they say well they stole our land they took our land now it's time for us to take our land back and tax everybody for rent they, they want to live on our land they have to pay us rent and I'm like hey everybody wants to fight for, for stupid reasons how come we can't fight for stupid reasons too and I'm like oh man but you know I, I try to talk them out of it but then again you know they tired telling me how who am I to say that they can't do that since everyone's all doing whatever they're doing so I said, you know what, if you guys are going to do what you guys going to do, do what you guys are going to do. But other than that, guys, this is just some crazy stuff happening out here right now. I just, why I prayed, I said that, that prayer. Because everyone right now is getting used as objects right now and, 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 for, and, and for greed right now. Everyone right now out there right now, everyone. The, uh, put it this way. You send, you send your minions to do your dirty work. You have, remember, you wash your hands because you don't have your hands dirty. Even though you're still associated, but you don't have your hands dirty because you weren't the ones that did it. So that's why I said they're using them as objects. And, and for greed. Because the reason why they're doing this. So that's why I said that prayer. I needed to say a prayer like that. Well, guys, I didn't mean to borrow you guys or get you guys into this stuff. But let's get you guys into some beautiful stuff right now. Let's get you guys in Atlanta. We're going to go down in order. Some of them, I think, like two photo folders I won't be able to share with you guys. So here, you guys got to uh, bear with me. I haven't, haven't set up my new laptop yet. I think I'm going to do that tonight, either tonight or tomorrow morning. One of the two, I'll probably get to set it up, get it all ready, good to go. And then um, I think what I'm going to do is use that laptop mainly more for that, for uh, what I do interviews or go live. Since I'll have a better connection, you know, I won't be lagging like this. So it won't give me problems. So I just use this one for when I do my videos and the other ones when I'm going to go live or, uh, you know, do interviews with people. That's what I feel like doing. Here, you got this object right there. This is Atlanta and then you got another one up here. All right, this was taken on the 13th. And you got another one right here. And where's this other one at? Here, here it is. All the way in here and then you have these two. Then you have that one down there too. I'm trying to hide. And then you have this one right there. See it? Peekaboo! Then you have that one right there. Birdie, see it? Then you have that one. That one right there. You barely make it out. Like these, you have to do some brightness and contrast to break this out. But like I told you guys, here's that one on the bottom right there. And I told you guys I wasn't going to do you no know, brightness and contrast. I'd rather show you guys the photographs, the original way to show you guys what's out there, what's there. Cause if I can't show you guys the original way, then what's the whole? Point? Look at that! One, two, three, four. It kind of looks like this is a system. The one, like the system with all the moons around it. Look at that! I'm not saying it is, but it looks like it. I'm not saying it is. You got your object there, there, there. Oh, yeah. And we're back right here in the beginning. Yep. Yeah, we're back right here in the beginning. Let's go to his uh, other photographs that he caught today. Got this one. Caught that one today too myself. That one, and you have that one. You have that one. That one. 
You got one, same one. Then you have that one. That one looks like a stripe one too, huh guys? Like Thetchy. So I showed you guys that picture of Thetchy. When I saw that, first thing I said, yeah, it has to be Thetchy, man. I bet you that's part of the Planet X system, and they're not even telling us. And we're back here in the beginning. Didn't get that much today from him. Let's go with uh, Tommy B out there in Ohio. He's got an object here. He's got two objects there. Hold on, guys. I'm sorry, but I'm sorry about that, guys. I don't know what happened. My thing just shut off on me, real, all crazy, like someone was controlling it. I didn't even shut it off. I just said, "Hey, let's do this," and boom. Then you got two objects right here, guys. I'm sorry about that. We're starting off all over again. Wow, this is some crazy things, man. Two objects here, 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 there. Like I said, there. There. There's your object right there. Objects are right there. Object is right there. There. Right there. There. Cut that one today too. Look at that one right there. Ooh. You see it right there. Look at that. Awesome. Awesome catch, Tommy. And we're back right here in the beginning, yeah. And we could, that one's not, not really nothing uh, that serious. This is Maria's photograph to show you. She said this is our son. This was an object that just picked out of nowhere, just came out of nowhere. I'll just we did. She did some work on it just to show you guys. This is her work, what she did. I did do not one work to this. She did this herself. This is her her work. This is what she did. This is what she says she caught. So I'm sharing with you guys. See the object right there. See, there's some objects going crazy, going around all crazy, guys. Yeah, we're back here in the beginning. And we got some more again. Don't know what the heck this is, but you guys can see it. This is a halo. And this is an object was right there, right in the halo. Don't know what it is. I'm not going to say it's a planet or it could be a ship that's coming our direction. But this is the original photograph and here's the halo. They saw this object there. They did their own work on it and this is what they got. Don't know what it is. It's crazy. That one I won't show you guys. I'll do a video of that one alone. This is coming from Minnesota out there from Cat. He's caught an object. So this is his video. He took some screenshots of his video as you can see. He was looking through some of his stuff. Like I said, here's your lens flare. Here's your object. Object. That's the same thing Maria caught. So I told Maria that there's a guy who caught something the same way she did. Almost in the same location too. See your object right there? Here's your lens flare. Here's your object right there. You got your object. You got like a asteroid or something, even an object right there. Here's your lens flare. Like an asteroid or something up there, a rock. See that right there? Have that right there. That right there. What the same thing Atlanta caught? Look how long he's let his video. He let his camera. He let his camera sit on the video on 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 a tripod and just let it go for about an hour. Let it record, and this is what he caught for for within an hour. See that object move right there. And you caught that object right there. Like I said, some people just let their camera sit there. They go there. They go re review their. There's your object right there. They go review. There's your lens flare. Okay. They go review their videos and photographs, and this is what they end up finding. Then I want to. This is supposed to be like I guess the Anunnaki ship. I don't know. There's like a star back here with the Anunnaki ship. Who knows, man? Who knows? Get that object right there.
that one there. Okay, that one right there. That one right there. That one right there. It's not a flare, guys. I don't show you guys flares. That's your flare. Remember, the flare is a green color. It's not white. An object right there. Don't know what that is. It looks like a mirror. See your object right there? Flare's right here. So it can't be your flare. This can't be your flare. Your flare's down here. The object right there. And here's your object up here. So here's your flare. And then you have two objects right here. It's actually like what Orlando. It's actually something what I caught today too. Two little objects. You have that object there. Two objects right there. But my objects I caught were two right here. An object right there. And then he caught something else too. That was right here. Those two objects. There's that one right there. And then he caught another one. Watch. Let me see if I can find them. See the object. Yeah, right here. That one right here. See these two right here. Okay. Remember these two. He caught him again, but this time he caught him on this side. See this object again? Right there. Like I said, this isn't the lens flare, guys. That's your lens flare. This is your object. So don't go there and say, I show you guys the lens flares. I already showed you guys. I don't. <clears throat> Just don't like what people tell you. There they are. See those two objects again? Here's that one and that one right there. They're both on two different sides. This, is, this was caught today. The other one I showed you guys was right here. It was caught two days ago on the 13th. And this one was caught today on the 15th. So, you guys tell me what is it that we're seeing right there in the sky. I don't know. But this guy said that he's seen some crazy things up there in the sky. I told him I don't, I told him I don't, I don't, uh, I don't doubt him. And we're back right here in the beginning. And then I believe we got one last folder. It's mine. See the little one right there? That one. And we got these two right there that I caught. Then we got that one right there. Then we got that one. That one, I just didn't. Hold on. There's your object right there on the bottom. These two. Like that. Just that object was moving. And you have that one right there. See that right there? Same thing that the guy caught. There. There's that one that he caught and Atlanta caught. There's a one too there, right there. That, uh, what's the name caught? Um, in Atlanta, I mean, um, Tommy out there. The same thing that Tommy caught, I caught. See, it's right there. And this is what, uh, supposed to be the planet, but it's not a planet. I believe this is supposed to be a ship, a UFO or something, because this object moves differently than more than what any other planet does. I see this object goes like this, that, that, and it goes in there and it just takes off in. Planet don't do that. Planet don't go. The planet don't go here. Stop. They go this way, that way, that way, and then take off this way. If I, I'm gonna see if I can show you guys a video. You guys see that it goes this way, that way, this way, and boom, takes off. So it stops too. So it's not a planet. I think it's a. You got that right there. I think it's a ship. And yeah, we're back right here. I think in the beginning. Let me see. What's right here? I don't know. And right here, this is the north, uh, northeast, and there's like a sec. This is the sun. You can see the sun right here. The sun is setting. Northeast. I got the video right here, but I don't know if it'll play right. Let me see if it'll play right with us, so you guys can see it. Yeah, that's right there. There's a light source right here, northeast. It's so the northeast right there. Northeast, right? You go all the way out here. This is where our sun's at. This is where our sun's at. Look at all this sky. Look at the way the sky looks. Look at the way the sky looks. Go all the way around right here. You look like you got a light source way out here too. Right there. There is another light source right there. I'll show you guys again. That was that was like that was right there. That was like at uh, I think maybe like around 4:35, around 4:35. And this one right here that I'm gonna show you guys right now is that uh, I'm eating seeds of homemade uh, flower seeds, guys. I'm sorry. 
Look right here. That's the north. There's like a second sun right here. Is that the north right now? This is the north right here. That's the north. This is the, this is the northwest. This is where they're supposed to be where the sun sets east. West, I mean. Probably west right here. West. This is northwest right here. Sorry, guys. I'm eating, I'm eating seeds. Um, I mean homemade seeds. And then we got we got our sun right here in the north. That's crazy. Whatever it is, it's pretty bright right there. I mean, it's bright. You can see it with the naked eye, bright right here. That's why I came out here and did a video. Wow, look at that. Kill the east, too. There's the south. Southwest. Get to the west. Northeast again. Take a look at some of these clouds. Because sometimes some of these clouds, they say some of these clouds carry something in it. Just take a look at them. Looks a little weird. But I'll share this with you guys. That's weird right here in the north. Look at that. Right there, right in the north. I'm going to leave them out there one day, man. <clears throat> one. Excuse me, guys. It was freaking hot right now. I'm our, it's my dog right now. I think I'm going to leave them out here in the garage one day. Have a fan, and basically have one of those homemade fans too that you get a bu uh, bucket that you cu cut those three holes and you put ice and you put a fan right on top of it and you just let it blow, make it all cool. Oh man, I did that one day in here and let me tell you, I never felt my garage be so cool. It stayed cool for about a good, good three and a half hours. I'm not going to lie, almost about a three and a half hours. And then it started, you could start hitting, start feeling, getting musty, mud, you know, start getting all like, oh my God. I was like, no, so... This time I got smart. I ended up uh, getting through the, those three, I think it was a gallon and a half ice cream bowls that you sell out. They sell. Whatever it is, I got one of those and uh, it's actually six of those. I filled those up with water, put them in there, and I put three of those inside the bucket and I just let the fan go. I should put one each. Yeah, I should put one, but if I, I think if I do one, it'll probably last maybe about 45 minutes to an hour, but that would be good because if it lasts me three hours, like I say it does, so that means each ice each ice cube whatever it is gallon ice whatever uh, whatever i mean lasts is an hour so if i make six of them it'll last me six hours i just replace it just throw the water out and replace the ice it's pretty awesome guys you guys should see those on the internet on the internet i don't know if you guys seen those it's pretty awesome when i made me one of those i tried it out the very first time and i was like oh my god it felt felt cool for like you actually being inside a house you know you know you know how guys sometimes you know how it is out here very very hot you guys sweat when you first come out all musty and everything you feel all that feel that humid stuff but no 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 when you have this on and everything you don't feel that you feel like whew, that's what i feel have on right now that's what you feel here in the background right now if you guys hear the fan that's what i have right now i have the bucket on right now with the ice cube going in right now so if it feels good right now but it's it's hot let me tell you some places Right here when I move to certain places right here. Like right now when I move. When I went to go check out to see my dog. Before I, you know, I said I'm going to leave him out there. It's a crazy dog guys. He's a, he's a crazy dog but I love him. Crazy dog. I love you guys. Take care. God bless you guys.